Hey guys, what up here, and welcome back to NASCAR Thread 2003 for the All Star Open today. Not a points race, it is a uh, non points event. And obviously, since we don't have a win, we have to do the Open. So, welcome back. Last race was at Richmond, and we bullshitted probably the best finish that we could have ever gotten. And it was. I, I don't even want to spoil it. Just watch the race, then come back, and then you understand why I'm so excited. So. Uh, team management, I'm going to show you what the car we're going with for today, uh, for this uh, open. Uh, we have 100% condition car, so that's the best we technically have chassis. We have the AK, the one with the, the good tire wear and stuff implemented into it, so there's that. So, 54 car rating, which is nice. So, anyways, without further ado, let's get into the race and show you the setup. Not in that order, and we'll, uh, we'll see how this turns out. Here's the setup for tonight's race. For the most part, I think it's the same as the site itself. Maybe the wedge, I, made it, I might have changed it, I'm not too sure, but yeah, we extended fourth gear. That's really the extent of that section, so um, let's just get right into the race. We don't have qualifying, so the field's just in, in random order, so yeah, it's all going to depend on wherever we start, so yeah, let's get this thing underway. The All-Star Open is a qualifier, only the winner will advance to compete in the All-Star, so that already puts us at a pretty big disadvantage. Looks like Jeff Purvis and Matt Kenseth are in the front row. Let's, uh, let's get this open underway. Three, two, one. Green flags out. We got seven quick laps of this. We're in seven, so that's cute. Do we have the car to win if Purvis holds up everyone? Maybe, but I, I have no idea. But one thing to take into consideration with this short amount of laps that the tire wear is going to just drop off violently because it... It does that a lot here, uh, with like the short amount of laps. That's just how the game works, which is, uh, it sucks, because we, I don't know how long we're going to be competitive, but at least we passed Casey Kane, so I mean, I mean, it says that we're, we aren't the absolute bottom of the barrel garbage cars, so that's something to take note of. Kenseth gets around Purvis, and I... I don't think we're going to catch that. Maybe Kurt Busch and maybe Jeff, but that that might be it. Because, I mean, there's no way we're going to be able to compete with top-tier drivers like Kenseth. Well, I mean, I guess so. But a better equipped car than I, I should say. Kurt Busch gets by Jeff Purvis, and now we're catching him as well. So we should be able to get the fourth position, possibly? I don't know. The tires are starting to kind of drop off a lot now, so I, I don't know. I just want to get by him. Just to, just to feel better about myself. Because the, we're, we're not going to advance. We're just, there's no way we're going to advance. And we win that corner way too deep, God forbid. And our GRAC attire wear things up. So that's that's lovely. But can we catch the purpose? I, I don't know. We'll see. We get a great run the straightaway. This gives me a little bit of hope for the, uh, the Coke 600 at least. Because we're running... Despite the, the, the immense tire wear that's about like times eight instead of times four, and somebody's blown a motor up there. Who was it? That was Kurt Busch who was in third, and uh, now we move into third. Well, well, what are the odds of that? And Purvis is continuing to race me very aggressively for third. All right. Okay. Oh, God. I don't know what that was. Okay, now we clear him. And he hits the outside wall. He just couldn't handle himself, so he wanted to end his career prematurely like he did in real life. That's fucked up. I'm sorry. Oh my, come on. Oh, that's what I get for uh, saying that. I just hit the outside wall. That's, that's you know, I deserve it. You know, every time I, I say something mean, immediately after something happens. So, you know, karma, I, I think exists. Or it's just me sucking ass, like right there. Oh my god. Well, Purvis is, you know, this, this is a, the most epic battle for third in the open right now. Like, I don't even think the announcers are caring who's leading. They're just talking about this Purvis guy and this is Dario Kowicki guy racing it back here like a bunch of dumbasses that like hit the outside wall of the last lap every quarter. And he obviously gets by me. I can't even, I can't even turn. Like, I have to go like under like 140 just to maintain the corner speed. It's, that's unbelievable. Uh, Jimmy or Kenseth wins. We're going to get fourth. I don't, I don't think there was really much I could really do to, to compete with those two. And yeah, Jimmy wins, so good, good on Jimmy. And uh, 
what, and there's, there's really I, there's nothing much more I could have done as we just don't have the speed there to compete. Oh my god. Well, that was that was a short race. <laughs> Next race is the Coca-Cola Racing Family 600. That oh, that open was very uneventful. I feel like so uh, because of that, I will not be uploading just this for today. It will be uh, later today, there will be the, uh, the the Coke 600 as well, so you'll be getting two uploads today because this is way too short and I'm not going to just upload this for the day and it's only going to be like maybe five, six, seven minutes. So um, yeah, that's 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 what's going to happen. So you're going to get two videos today. So yeah, I think that's fair. Anyways, uh, there's nothing more to show. I mean, the wear and everything doesn't go down, it's just like NASCAR 2004, so we still have 100% uh, conditioned everything, so... Yeah, we're, we're good to go, and I have a little bit of hope going into the 600, considering we weren't garbage. We passed Casey Kane, so I mean, that's something, so. I don't know. Anyways, uh, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Like I always say, I do appreciate love, feedback, and support. All you guys give me in the comment section below, and as well as liking the video, because it helps me out a lot in the long run. I'll see you all for the longest race of the season. And as always, have a good day, everyone.